now we will look at setting up and amending the pastoral structure. We need to go into Focus, School, Pastoral Structure, Next Academic Year Structure. Make sure you select Next Academic Year Structure to work on next year and not select Current Structure. Simpson load the structure from the current year as a template to work on for next year. Please ensure that the changes you are making here are finalized before the school breaks up. To see the year groups, click on the plus next to the pastoral structure to see the class and to see the classes within the year groups, click on the plus next to the relevant year group and then click on the plus next to the folder called registration group. If you need to delete a class, right click on the class and click on remove. You will be prompted whether or not you want to continue as the group will be deleted, but rest assured that the class will only be removed from the pastoral structure and not deleted of sims. If you need to add a group, right click on the folder called registration group and click on new registration group and then enter the details. To select a teacher to be assigned to the group, click on the binoculars and then search for the teacher. Keep in mind that the teacher will need to be on Sims for you to be able to assign them to a class. If the details you entered were of a previous class used in Sims, Sims will ask if you want to reuse that class. I will click yes here and then click on OK, and then click OK again. Alternatively, you can also right click on the folder called Registration Group, and then click on Reuse Old Registration Group. A note of warning is to not rename classes. If you rename a class in next academic year, it will also be renamed in the current academic year, as well as the previous academic, year, academic years. If you are addressing a spelling mistake or formatting a change, such as removing a trailing space or making letter uppercase instead of lower, then this is fine. If you need to remove a teacher from a class, right click on the, on the class, click on properties, and then where it says registration tutor, click on the red cross. Once you're happy with your changes, click on the save button on the top left, and this will have saved your pastoral structure. You can keep going back and make additional changes where needed. This does not have to be done in one sitting, but be aware that you want to make sure that this is completed before the school breaks up. Next, we'll be looking at the promotion where we will be telling Sims where students are going to next academic year. To access this, we will be going into routines, school and promotion. Sims will ask to run a data check. It will always ask to do this. So we're going to click OK. This will take a few minutes. Once it has loaded, this screen will come up and Sims will ask where to promote from. So we want to ensure that we select the current academic year. We'll be clicking on load. The top half of the screen is showing the year promotion. So reception goes into year one, year one goes into year two, year two into three, etc. So make sure that this is correct. You can make changes by clicking inside the fields for promotion path and select the, the, the corresponding year. The bottom half is asking for class promotions. This is the part where things could be very easy or more difficult depending on what your school is doing. If your school is keeping the students together, you can make the promotion straightforward by selecting the corresponding class in the promotion path. If the school is mixing things up, then you will not be able to select a promotion path and you will have to do things manually. Let's go with the notion that the school is mixing the students up. So I'll be unselecting my promotion paths. There are other options, such as the options to promote class teachers, as well as supervisors by clicking the box on the right hand side. And this will mean that the teachers will get promoted too. You can also click on the override membership boxes 
if you want to override a previously ran promotion. We will click on finish to leave things as they are. On this screen, we can double click on the gray bars to expand the year group. And under the next registration group, we can select from the drop down menu where the students are going next academic year. This is one place where we can make changes manually. Once we're happy with that, we can click on the save button to save our changes. We can also go back into next year's pastoral structure because we have promoted the students into the year groups for next year. And we can assign them to the classes from the next academic year structure. If we expand the pastoral structure and expand a year group, and then right click on the folder called registration group, and then click on members. It will bring up the year two members for next academic year and the classes, and we can click inside the classes to assign the students to the classes for next academic year. Once we're happy, we click OK, and the students have now been assigned to their classes. These are the two ways how you can assign students to the classes for next academic year if you want to do this manually. We also have, if I bring the screen up once again, under actions, the option to click on view triple. So we can have a nice breakdown to see the breakdown between male and female students in the corresponding classes.